Hello and welcome back again, my friend, to the Bitcoin price prediction or Bitcoin forecast or BTC price prediction. This is Thomas with you again. We came back in another video. So as every time, if you are a long term trader, stick only with weekly and daily and you're going to find the timeline is down in the, of the video. If you are a swing trader, we're going to analyze for you the Bitcoin in the four hours. And if you are a scalper and a day trader in 30 minutes. So let's start our lesson of today guys. So as you see here, the weekly candle here, it's finished here in that zone and everything is going very, very, very good. How else we accept it exactly? Because if you remember people being with us for some time, as we said here in the weekly, we got here a wake off like that. And that one here that breakout, which is here, if it's breaking up here and doing like that, is going to indicate in that 15k we reach to it here is the bottom till now it has a breaking up here so us technically we still below the 200 then the 200 moving average that meant us we still in a downtrend and nothing was changed till wednesday when the fed or the jerome power going to come and talk to us and tell us what is it the right decision because majority of investors they still waiting what's going to happen but if you are a long-term investors forget about all that and just they say because if you're remember what me i told you we got here a cup and handle like that when it's getting broke here it's indicating the market will go more higher and the target of that one just make it like that it's going to go tell here tell that last zone here of that one as you see it that one here is it a 30k so the bitcoin here it's showing it's going to 30k there is no one will stop it from that and even here what we got if you remember we got here the top of that trend line or that wage as we have here in weekly if you remember it, it started from here and here. Now it's getting broke here. That one when it's getting broke, it's indicating that the market will go back where it fell down before here at 69k. So the Bitcoin is showing here is it going up to here. But me, I'm still waiting that break here of the 200 moving average here. To indicating for me that the bottom in real because it might to make here another correction. To touch it here then after that to break up maybe it's going to make like that that's another scenario but us now here we are in the bottom and all those people discarding you online and those things don't follow them bitcoin started getting bottom even if you see our indicator here we've been telling you that i think four months now that one when it's entered here to the oversold area every time that the bottom even if we zoom it out like that thousands of years back is the same thing as you see it as you see all those times here that was me i've been telling you all along as you see here when it entered to the oversold area it entered to the oversold area and now it entered here to the oversold area so that is going to drive the bitcoin much higher you are here in that level you are in a very close level and and you are in an accumulation level the only thing now we need the bitcoin to break above the 200 moving average here to indicate for us that the bottom like how it's happened here and here and all those times before yeah no we haven't breaking so we need to wait in a little bit that's what me have been telling you now let's go to see the coming news for tomorrow for the picture to get more clear to you so let's see in there so let's go in there there we are there is nothing special for tomorrow as you see it is the only the gdp for you uh, germany that one it doesn't got a big uh, impact to the crypto currency world but here our table that friend of us here that one us we follow it every day what it telling us here all your stocks today they are green as you see them so the market it started reversing and here the vex is getting lower and lower now it's 18.51 that's when people they are not scared like how it used to be above 20 now so for long term investors is the right time there is no big volatility now and we're going to see a big move and even the us dollar here it's showing it's falling that because that one it's working vice versa against the bitcoin when the bitcoin is going up the us dollar is falling so that's what it's showing to us here i think everything is too clear here now it's going to see what the bitcoin doing right now in daily so it's going there here we are in the daily here in the daily today the bitcoin is doing something bigger here the portion all along up here but what me i told you here at that candle there what me i told you about it even if we zoom it like that what me i told you about that candle here that one here what me i said about it that one here i said you got here an inside bar it's need a candle to come to break here i'm talking here just about daily there is no candle breaking up and there is no candle breaking down so you still here 
sideways inside that one even that candle came today and pushing all that much up and i'm going to show you why i'm still thinking of we need to wait in because tomorrow is monday if tomorrow came a red candle here you're going to see the bitcoin going more higher because tell no also still waiting what's going to happen and the people they follow me in the my telegram channel when it just breaking here i tell it to them so here in the daily was it showing to us after the break of the trend line here it's showing it's still going up maybe it's going to go till 24k or 25k but in the last friday what else we make here the two lines here that yellow ones that one here for the options where they are the calls and where, where they are the pots the calls they are at 25k and the pots they are at 21k so the big wells they're thinking the bitcoin is going to stay all the week here will not break 25k and it will not break 21k that's what me i'm thinking of i think it's going to make a small correction to here touch the trend line here then after that it will go up that uh scenario another scenario if it's breaking the 200 moving average you're going to see the bitcoin going very 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 sharp up so you if you haven't entered yet try to be in the bus as quickly as some possible bitcoin it started his bull run and all the metric they're telling you that so don't try to be late that said that the only thing i can tell you now and here what else we got talk with me here we're still waiting the break to happen here that the last defense we got here is that one that one where we are now here that level here that one is the last one if we break it we're going to go to 30k here if we break that one now if a candle came up breaking here we're going to go to 30k and good morning to the earning me personally now I'm making very nice profit but it's up to you people they've been with us from down here we've been buying and here all along we've been buying from here now look where we are if we break in that last defense we got here you're going to go see the bitcoin going to 30k that one no one will stop it so let's see till wednesday was going to happen then we're going to come back to you now let's go into the four hours to see what the bitcoin doing today for swing trading so let's go in there here we are in the four hours here in the four hours what else we said we said we got here like that channel here or that flag here we said if it's getting broke up here we will enter long it's getting broke here people will dive you now you need to be inside in the market look where you are now if it's make a correction maybe it's going to make a correction tomorrow like that to here and after that you're going to see it going up but now you are in an up trend yes you we got a divergence and a very clear divergence in our indicator and i'm going to show it to you when we came there but also we follow the price action not the indicators price action is showing us here we used to have here a flag like that over here we used to have a flag like that and even that flag now is getting broke here as you see it you need to bring that line here and to make it exactly take profit let me show it to you so you need to make it like that look with me here here and down here that's what else we said before all so the flag like that now it's getting broke you bring the same line and you do it like that so the bitcoin it will go more than 25k here it's showing that was it showing to us maybe you're going to see tomorrow another correction to here to touch that line from the top but till now us we showing here it's still going up and it's breaking for us that last high where it's uh, reaching here so people in lower time frames for scalping i will give them yesterday a signal to enter from down here then they enter and people they make a nice profit with us and you can go to our telegram channel and you see their people they saying they make a very nice profit or so even you can join us if you want that is up to you so now what is it the view the view here i think we still continue upward or maybe another scenario because as you remember what me i told you here i told you we got here an up channel like that like that i told you we're touching the lower of it here it might from here it will go in upward to touch the top of it here again so let's still wait on what's going to happen and here some people they said we got here a triangle like that and that triangle is getting broke here even though one you can take it a triangle it doesn't touch the lower of it so you can just make it a triangle why should you make a triangle and you got here a very clear flag like that look at it very clear flag like how it used to be here and that's what me i told you i told you between that how it's working phases that the second phase now it's need to give us the third phase and the fourth phase now you are in a all trend and look at it the bitcoin is going very 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 sharp high so we need to wait in what's going to come in the coming days 
now it's going to see our indicators what they saying that one here that one will make me stay all worried till now is it that one because that one look at it here you got here a very clear divergence here even today that pushing up today it just touching for us the divergence line here so you need to be careful of about even that one for you to enter short now and the place where you to enter short short to make with us that channel how we make it like that and if it's getting broke lower here we will close in all our long position and we will enter a short because now us we got there a divergence as you see if it's getting broke we will close everything and me tell now i'm still believing that one here it will falling down to touch for us here that line here then after that will go back up so you need to be careful about that one it's need to break for us the last high which is here or it's need to fall down again to the oversold area then after that to go up you need to be careful the entry doesn't it's not from those levels the entry it's always from down i'm talking here just about swing trading let's see our other indicator was it saying that one here as you see it is it here at the overbought area so even that one it need to make you to be worried a little bit because yes it's just an oscillator but you got a divergence in another oscillator and that one here what we got now we got that one i show it to you we got here that up channel like that that one if it came and break a lower here yes you can enter short because look where you are you are in a very stronger supply and demand zone and that one also we wait it if it's getting broken here that one we're going to go to 30k there is no one will stop it from that so you need to make a close eye at those things me i'm telling you if we break in here we're going to go to 30k there is no one will stop us but if it came and break a lower here the lower of that channel enter short close out the long and enter short because it's going to fall down till here tell the 200 moving average here is it at 20k or 18 or 19k so from here till there is a big losses so if you you are in profit now try to protect yourself and try to move stop loose people to be in entering with us from down i'm talking here just about swing trading i think everything is too clear now it's going to see 30 minutes what is it there for picture to get more clear to you so it's going there here we are in 30 minutes here i remember it very 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 well i told you we got here a head and shoulder here here the neckline it's being here it's getting broke here and we told you here take profit for that one it needs to be here exactly in that one you can find it just in the last two videos just go back to them and watch them look where we are and here in the last video the last video where i analyze for you only bitcoin in the last part of 30 minutes what me i told you i told you like that and like that me i remember it very 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 well I told you we got here a symmetric triangle it's getting broke here i told you take profit of it it needs to be here it bring for you both of those signals they break both of them they bring for you the take profit look at them there is nothing complicated now what shall we do in that level here we got any price action no we don't got any price action the level here yes is a very stronger supply and demand zone he tried to break it here but it go back inside so tell no we haven't breaking that last high here price action did we got any price action there you can make like that a up channel like that but that one is not clear because if it's breaking here you can enter again to here to the 200 moving average but look with me how i draw it that up channel you came to those ones like that and you draw it like that so you're waiting if it came and break a lower here you enter short or you drawing just a uptrend like that but if it give you here another price action because tell now it try to give you here a double top so you need to wait in a little bit to give you the market here a price action indicating the market is going to reverse tell now there is nothing so you need to wait in more here in 30 minutes now as we're talking and it's showing it reversing here and as you see it here try to give you here like a double top if it's breaking the neckline here you can enter short but me as i told you you draw it like that that one here you came to the two dot down here that one here and that one here and you draw in an uptrend like that if it came and break a lower here you enter short take profit of you it need to be here at the 200 moving average and the stop loss you put it here in the top of that peak here i think everything is too clear let's see our indicator what it's saying our indicator as you see it it's showing us us here we are at the overbought area so technically now we need to look in for a short opportunity short opportunity as i tell it to you us we are in a very stronger supply and demand zone as you see it there second thing you got here that up channel as i show you just few minutes now like that if it came here and break a lower here you can enter short again take profit it need to be here at the 200 moving average you need to be looking very 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 careful about those things i think everything is too clear guys
fun that's it for that video and please don't forget to support us by smashing the like button writing down a comment if you could so that's it for that video see you after european market close bye for now